Today we're going to look into Superman and the Authority number two. Written by Grant Morrison with art by Michael Yanin, Fico Osio, Evan Cagle, and Travel Foreman. Manchester Black is still hanging out at the Fortress of Solitude with Superman, waiting to see what they're going to do next about putting this team together. Meanwhile, even in his weakened state, Superman continues to keep his health up. Way up. Afterwards, Superman tells Black that it's time to begin the recruitment. In Metropolis, John Henry Irons is having a crisis as some hostile digital life forms are attacking. Lucky for him, his niece Natasha was visiting, and she's fully prepared to deal with it. She appears to be fighting manifestations of the internet like a parade of endless clickbait and even body shaming trolls. And when she sees the life form's next manifestation, she realizes what's happening here. She lets the life form know that this is not the way to go about first contact, so she agrees to help if it'll stop its rampage. Back at the fortress, Superman lets Black know that it was he who recruited Natasha, so Black can't take credit for that one. So Superman tells him that he can redeem himself as they get ready to head out for their next recruits. <music> Apollo and Midnighter seem to be next on the recruitment list. And they are currently in Yemen following a group that kidnapped some children and turned them into some Frankenstein style experiments. <coughs> they start their creature on the move. But Midnighter makes his move and they stand no chance. But as Midnighter is busy celebrating his victory, he gets a little careless. And the creature takes full advantage of this distraction. Lucky for Midnighter, Apollo is ready to back him up. As they recover from the mission, Midnighter lets Apollo know that as an anniversary present, he has arranged for them to be on a team with Superman. Being a huge Superman fan, Apollo is ecstatic as they rendezvous with Superman and Black and discuss who their next recruit will be. Somewhere on a very dark and stormy night, a young couple makes their way to a creepy hotel where they are met by an unusual host. He leads them to where a supposed masquerade party is supposed to be happening. We learn this is June Moon and that her date has actually set all this up on purpose. His goal being to get access to the Enchantress. He has pledged June's eternal soul to a being called Desamor. And now he has come to collect. And with that, June begins to experience all sorts of horrors. Lucky for June, the team is about to mount a rescue. June is in a weakened state from all the torture but Desamor is about to make his move. Until... A bright light fills the room and June can finally see her saviors. Superman tells June that she is in hell and they have actually come to save her. And there you have Superman and the Authority number two. Wow, what a wild issue. Grant Morrison sure loves his out there concepts. That's why I felt like it took me longer to put this video together because as you saw there by the end, when they go see Enchantress, I pretty much was putting together a monster movie it felt like. 
I read somewhere this is supposed to be like another alternate DC. That's why we have a different Superman, but that's not made clear here in the story yet. And it's only four issues long, so it seems like we're really taking our time recruiting these characters. So I know that there's going to be more done afterwards, but I really hope it does come together in some fashion here because I would hate for this whole four issue miniseries to literally just introduce the team and they don't really seem to do anything beyond that. But for now, I'm just going to trust that there's a plan. So we still have some other people to recruit into the team here. So we'll see what the next issue brings. So if you like this video, be sure and hit like and please subscribe because I'll be hitting the rest of the parts of this miniseries as well as some of the other Wildstorm character appearances in the DCU and some of the old Wildstorm stuff as well. So until then, we'll see you next time.